Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Raylin. My husband and I have been on a journey to become debt free and more financially stable since November of 2023. We utilize a zero based budget to tell our money where to go instead of wondering where it went. After adapting to this lifestyle, we noticed the financial aspect of our lives change for the better. I film these videos to hold ourselves accountable and hopefully inspire others along the way. If you're interested in following along, just keep watching. Hey guys, welcome back to another cash stuffing video. Today I'm gonna to be cash stuffing for the fourth week of November and we have a total of $568 going into our sinking funds and savings challenges. So let's go ahead and get right into it. Starting off with my wallet, uh, we have the $200 left over in groceries and you guys, that is not true. I'm just gonna keep this in here to make my Sam's Club credit card payments. Um, I believe all of it is gonna go towards that. So yeah, um, household was spent. Kids was also spent. Miscellaneous, we're gonna take out. And I didn't have any personal spending money last week. So um, for groceries, we're gonna go ahead and add 200 to it. So I have a 150. 20s and a 10. So there should be a one, 150, 170, 190, $200 going in. So groceries has 100, 200, 300, 350, 370, 390, $400. Household is going to be getting 20. Kids is going to be getting 10. Miscellaneous is going to be getting 10. And that is all for my wallet. Going into my wallet overflow binder. Gas is going to be getting 30 this week. And I think I'm going to start cash stuffing this envelope because um, my Sam's Club credit card, I get a lot of money back when I buy gas on it. So I'm just gonna stuff the cash in here that I would weekly and then just use the cash to make my credit card payment at Sam's Club. So that way I get more rewards back. So gas now has 50, 70, 80, 90, 100. Um, household was stuffed in my wallet. Kids was also stuffed in my wallet. Same with miscellaneous. And Justin's gonna get 40. So we have 20, 30, and 40 for Justin. My personal spending's getting skipped and same with my kids. And that's all for my wallet overflow. Going into my high priority binder. Coffee is gonna be receiving $10. Two, four, six, eight, 10. So coffee now has 10 and $20. And this tracker is from Sassy Peanut Budgets, Stephanie. If you guys aren't following her, she's on Instagram and just recently started a YouTube channel. She has an Etsy shop and sells digital downloads. So go check her out. She is so sweet. Personal hygiene is going to be receiving 10 so personal hygiene now has 10, 20, 30, and 40. And I did do kind of a big unstuffing off camera. It was so much and I just didn't want to feel overwhelmed on camera doing it. So if you notice my envelopes a lot lower than normal, that is why. Um, the weans are getting $20 this week. So the weans now have 50, 70, 71, 72, 73, and 74. 
And Zeke is now on prescription dog food. And his dog food uh, was, what, I think $45 for a six pound bag and over $100 for a bigger bag at the vet. So I'm gonna have to like order it off Chewy.com or something and see if it's any cheaper there. But yeah, we'll have to be cash stuffing a little more in this envelope going forward, which is totally fine. Clothing is going to be receiving 20 and we have completely depleted this envelope. As you can tell, <laughs> Target had an amazing clothing sale for the girls and I couldn't pass it up. So, yep. Um, school is getting skipped this week and same with electricity. Yearly subscriptions is getting five. So yearly subscriptions has 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, and $50. We're almost there to pay my Costco membership card. Um, we only have like the gold membership, so I think it's 65 or $60. So getting close there. Um, yearly, or not yearly, vehicle maintenance is getting $10. Vehicle maintenance has 200 set aside in our high yield savings account to 20, 230, 240, 250, and 260 total. Health is going to be getting 10. Health now has 100, 200, 220, 230, 240, and 250. Copays is going to be getting $20. This one's a little bit higher than normal because my girls have a dentist appointment coming up. So yeah. So Copays now has 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 110, 115, 120. Medical is gonna be getting 10. So medical now has 1,100 in our high yield, 50, 70, 80, 90, 1200, 1210 total. And emergency is going to be getting 10. So I'm going to go ahead and check off a 10 on this tracker. So let's, I'm just going to do these two fives. And this tracker is from Angela over at Enzo Budgets. She just came out with a new version, which is super cute. And we need to add the $10 before I forget. So emergency now has 1,100 in our high yield, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90. So 1,190 total. And I always have Angela's Etsy shop link down below. And that is all for my high priority binder. All right, moving on to low priority. So what do we have here? Beauty is gonna be receiving 20. And this tracker is from Maddie over at Budget with Maddie. And I have each icon worth $5. So I'm gonna fill in four of these nails. And put a 20 in there. So nails has, or beauty has 20 and $40, but it is for my nails, so. All right, and I'm gonna go ahead and update that really quick. So I know I missed last week, so we'll just um, so we have oh 20 40 total. And this expense tracker is from Melina over at the Millennial Dollar. All right, birthdays is getting $20. And you guys, I am so excited. Ah, 
it's like a dream come true. Um, I was able to score some Post Malone tickets. Oh my gosh, this, it's gonna be like the longest seven months of my life. <laughs> I, as you guys know, I am obsessed with him and so is my husband. So yeah, we have been dying to see him for years and just haven't been able to go. And he just announced his tour the other day and I was able to get tickets and they're pretty good tickets too. But yeah, so in June, we will be going to see him and um, it's gonna be my Christmas gift and my birthday gift combined and same with my husband. So we are so excited. Oh, I cannot wait. So birthdays now has 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. Gifts is gonna be getting 20. So Gifts now has 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. And Family Fun is gonna get 10. And we have planned a movie trip with the girls. They wanna go see Moana too. I think it comes out the day before Thanksgiving. So we're either gonna go that day or on Thanksgiving or the day after. And they are so excited. I am too, I love that movie. So Family Fun now has 20, 30, 40, 45. So we're gonna be using this plus um, money in their kids envelope so yeah um that is all for this binder how is your guys's week going i hope you all are doing amazing moving on to my holiday binder so we are going to go to Valentine's Day, and Valentine's Day is getting $5. And these trackers are from my shop. Um, I think they are sold out at the moment because I am just going to do a little update, not much. I'm just going to redo my logo here. I found um, I want all my trackers to be cohesive, and so there's a different font I want to use for my logo here at the bottom, and that's about it. So. Yeah, I am gonna be working on restocking those very shortly. Five, so Valentine's Day now has five and $10. Easter is getting five, and my husband and I did decide to move the Easter, the money that I had rollover from Thanksgiving and I had it in Easter and we it decided it would be a great idea to put it in Christmas because we are needing more cash for that. So Easter now has five and ten dollars. And Mother's Day is gonna be getting stuffed for the first time in a while. And we're gonna do the same. So getting five and same with Father's Day it's getting five going to be getting 20. So Black Friday now has 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. And those Black Friday deals at Target, you guys keep getting me. So I keep having to make it an even 100 every week. <laughs> okay. And then Christmas, we are going to do Cooper's Savings Challenge here. And then I also just released these in my shop. As you guys know, like I don't even need to say it again, but 
yes, my Home Alone scratch-offs for Christmas are now available in my Etsy shop. I have a low denomination for $40, a medium denomination for $75, and a high denomination for $125, I believe. So, yes, go ahead and snag them while you can. So I'm actually gonna scratch off one today for next week. And for this savings challenge, this is from Purely Budgets. His name is Cooper. If you guys don't know about him, go check him out. I have his Etsy shop linked down below as well, always. And um, he also has a YouTube channel. So go check him out if you haven't already. So this one is a low denomination Christmas day savings challenge and you save $30. So. I'm going to be stuffing 15 today, so let's go ahead and check some of these off that equal 15. So we have, there's five here, four and one, five here, three and two, and then another five. Cool. So 15. Let that dry and... I took out my placeholder that was in here, you guys, because as I'm Christmas shopping, the amount changes like every day, multiple times a day. So <laughs> it's just so much easier to have this custom placeholder in here. And this idea I got from Melina over at the Millennial Dollar. And so, yeah, um, I am using that for my Christmas envelope right now. So we have 125 in my high yield savings account, 175 one huh? I'm gonna count this backwards so 125 175 180 190 210 I think I know I have to count that so weird I am not good with odds you guys so I think we have 210 in there I'm gonna put this in this and then I'm going to go ahead and scratch off one of my tracker circles for next week. We need to save some more money now for Christmas. All right, so you guys, this is even a surprise to me because I don't remember how I put the numbers. So we will be stuffing $10 next week. An additional 10 so probably 25 for the remaining 15 of Cooper's challenge and then 10 for mine so yeah um, New Year's is fully funded and then the next thing was seasons and I need to stuff this eight dollars here that I scratched off last week so we have five six seven and eight so seasons now has five ten 11, 12, 13 dollars. And I am gonna scratch off another circle for next week. And this is from Maddie over at Budget with Maddie. She makes the cutest scratch offs. So we scratched off number seven for next week. So I will be sure to budget that in. And that is all for my holiday binder. All right, I lied. So I'm gonna go ahead, I say I have $10 remaining here. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and stuff that into Christmas because we really need that. So I could just stuff this and then I'll scratch off another one. There we go, that works out. So Christmas should have 220 now and I'm not about to count that again. <laughs> so scratch off another one. All right, I scratched off 
$15. So we will be putting 15 in there next week and then another 15, so 30 next week, which will be great. All right, and that's all for my holiday binder for real this time. All right, you guys, that is all I had for today's cash stuffing video. Thank you so, so much for watching if you have made it this far. If you guys enjoyed this video, please go ahead and leave me a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you in my next one, guys. Bye.